Today I'm going to take you through this 52 Manhattan from Sunseeker. Starting on the back of the boat, we've got a huge hydraulic platform, so this drops into the water. You can store your jet ski, your tenders, your jet tenders on here. It's coupled with the beach club here, so there's a seat that pulls out of here. We've got the electric grill. We've got a nice shower arrangement here, so this pops up and it gives you an overhead shower, as well as access to the crew quarters on the port side. Coming aboard, we've got two or three steps coming up to the back of the boat. This boat's equipped with the optional mooring winches. We've got a nice overhang here, so we've got seating for four at the table. Nice big teak table. And you're under cover. So if it's raining or the weather's not so good, you want some protection from the sun, you can get that here with this fixed overhang. Very quickly, this is the door in the closed configuration. So to open the door, nice solid stainless steel door arrangement. We open the main doors. They swing out way right beside the stairs. And then this partition drops into the ball pit here right behind the bar. So what you get is this really open, airy feel right in the aft section of the galley on this boat. You can be serving drinks, food, cocktails right to the guests who are outside without everybody going all the way through the boat. So you kind of got that social space at the back of the boat flowing right into the social space on the outside of the boat. Moving forward, we've got a fixed dinette here to port. The tables do fold up to give you more space. Or if you're dining and entertaining with more people, you can open it up. Seat six around the side, and you can have another one or two folding chairs that come out if you had a larger group that we're going to be eating inside. So set to starboard. So you can have a social space, nice conversation going on here. Um, the helms people, if you're driving from below, driving here, you're not separated from the entertaining. You're just always with the group together. Great sight lines, opening windows on starboard. You can really drive this boat from down below or from up top in inclement weather. Just come down here, you get out of the elements, and uh, you can stay with your group. Stepping below, 52 Manhattan has three staterooms, VIP forward, guest cabin to starboard, and the master aft. So the guest cabin is set up with two individual single bunks. Tons of natural light in this guest cabin, so we're still we're tying into some of those accent windows on the side of the hall. There's an opening port light, brings the natural light in, makes the room feel very, very large. Forward, similar aspect in the VIP because you've got the accent windows, opening port lights, and up above, we've got access to an opening, an opening hatch, as well as a fixed skylight. So it's bringing more of that natural light inside the boat. VIP has access to an ensuite head, which also doubles as the day head. So VIP have their own private entrance, and there's a secondary door that'll let the day guests come and use it without coming through the bedrooms. Moving aft, we have the master. This boat's set up with hardwood throughout. It's two steps down into the master. Again, I always like to show off. I'm six foot six, so there's six, seven, six, eight of headroom in here. Full beam master. We've got the sete seating to port and storage to starboard. Large flat screen TV. Tons of natural light, huge windows here, and a very large opening port light on both sides to get a little bit of cross breeze if you like. So if you bear with me, we'll head outside back through the salon and up to the flybridge. Lots of headroom through the main salon as well. Easily 6'8, six, 6'9. Six, Steps down, but you maintain that headroom as you go outside. There's additional joystick docking station here. You've got the Volvo joystick, side thruster controls here. A little bit of a Volvo Pento control so you can kind of see what's going on with the engine. So while you're docking in close quarters, you can do it right here from the aft of the boat. 
we'll pop upstairs. Nice solid set of stairs going up to the top of the fly bridge. So it's not a ladder, the full, full tread, full depth, so you feel comfortable and secure going up. Nice steady stainless steel handrail to get you up top. So bear with us, it's a little bit noisy here today. But we've got our helm seats to starboard, so the, the driver and a co-pilot are sitting side by side. There's a lot of additional seating here, so you can do the facing forwards as you're driving, socializing. Sun pad up forward. And then the aft, you've got this ginormous seating arrangement here. Where you can sit eight people quite comfortably. around the teak table. You can option a grill here, an ice box. This boat doesn't have the grill, but you can get a grill. There's an ice box, chill box here, lots of storage up here. Uh, we've got the hard top on this boat with an extendable electric sunshade out the back and an opening sunroof. of the Manhattan 52 is the four deck seating so that table can drop and create a giant sun pad or as it's set up right now you can take the cushions off the top and have a nice place for cocktails while sitting up on the bow of the boat. Thanks very much for joining me on the walkthrough of the 2019 Sunseeker 52 Manhattan. If you have any questions please feel free to give us a call at MMA